Hello, what is going on guys? Lasty here. Welcome to yet another gameplay commentary on Black Ops from me. Look at this. This is my first game back on PS3. I did some sort of patch update and look what happened. Like, I went on Villa and everything looked really funny and really weird for like 10 seconds or so. And I was just sort of like dazed and like didn't know what was going on. So I took a death right at the start there. Um, but everything seemed to sort of level out from here and... Um, little quick, you know, I'll tell you exactly what I'm using. I'm using the AUG, uh, my favourite gun in this game, with the dual mag attachment, flak jacket, sleight of hand marathon. That's the classic sort of lasty setup. That's why I always use pretty much uh, if I'm trying to sort of get a game player or if I'm trying hard. Um, as I say, this is my first game back on PS3, and I instantly felt a lot more comfortable uh, with the controller, definitely. Uh, I felt like I could like win a gunfight. I know my accuracy is still not not great, but um, I felt like I could win gunfights and just felt a lot more comfortable on PS3 than I do on Xbox. But saying that, the connection on Xbox and the amount of people that are on Xbox is more than PS3. So that you know, each console has its benefits and that sort of thing. So uh, I jumped into a game of domination here. Uh, I was trying to play with someone, but they got kicked, and uh, so I went in. I was playing on my own, which is never a great idea when you're, you know, trying to play objective games. You all know that by now. But uh, I was having fun. I sort of realised a little bit that if I play in a group of six with people that, you know, people that I know, and they're all solid players, then I'm not going to come out on top of the leaderboard every time, and uh, a lot of the kills are going to get taken. That sort of thing, whereas if you go into a game on your own, which I've noticed a lot of YouTubers do, then it's a lot easier to get, a, you know, a gameplay. I mean, this isn't, you know, a brilliant score. I think it's like a plus 25 spread, so, uh, you know, I get 25 more kills than I get uh, any deaths, so that sort of thing, which, you know, it's pretty good. This, is, by the way, is a good spot to cap uh, B on this map. I'm sure a lot of you know that by now. I actually really like Villa. Uh, Villa's quite a nice map. One of my favourites. Again, I didn't think I was going to like it when this game came out, but turns out pretty pretty solid map. I, I like the domination maps, which where there's always a really big fight for B-Dom, because uh, as I say, you guys know me by now, I love to wear flak jacket and uh, just constantly go and jump on that flag and just have a laugh doing it. So uh, I love a game to ho a gameplay when, especially if the other team is quite competitive. I like it when people are constantly fighting for bead on because uh, if you get a team that are, are good at doing that, then normally you have you have a, a few a few you know chances where either you know the enemy team is going to stuff like four players on it and then you can turn the corner and get you know the possibility of getting a quad spray or uh, you know it's just going to be really competitive for the whole time and that sort of thing so it's really fun I love that um, it's better than playing like a bunch of six randoms who don't know what they're doing uh, you can tell that this area is quite good it's quite good for cover and that sort of thing um, I, I, th I thought I had something to talk about, but I can't quite remember what it was, sorry. Uh, oh yeah, so one of the things I was going to talk about was, uh, maybe I should wait, I think I get a quad here. We'll see. I think this is the game. Yeah, I think in my first game back I get a quad with the napalm, which... One, two, three, quad! Yeah, get the old quad feed there with the napalm, which... I was on Skype with Mike's antics and Nasty Monkeys at this time, so I think I just let out a little bit of a quad uh, when that happened. But it's always good. I love, I love that. I love getting quad feeds. Uh, it doesn't often happen to me with a gun, but you know, sometimes with the napalm and that sort of thing, it happens. Uh, but yeah, the one topic I had to talk about today um, was the podcast. Uh, a lot of you guys know that I've done, I think, is it three episodes of a podcast? Our podcast is called No Respawns. Um, it's basically just us, you know, me, Mike's Antics, Nasty Monkeys, Jamie's Gaming, Dan from Japan, and then sort of special guest every now and again. Uh, we just shoot shit and just, you know, talk random shit on the mic for an hour or so. 
Um, and it's really sort of laid back, chilled, and just fun. And, you know, we just talk, you know, we center it around gaming a lot of the time and that sort of thing, but um, we just have fun and, and just talk. And we haven't done it for a while because obviously I was on holiday and, and the other lads didn't, didn't actually do a podcast while I was away um, because I don't think they really met up too often on Skype and that sort of thing, which is fine. But uh, I wanted to make a point of trying to keep this podcast as a fairly, like a weekly thing. Like if we're all about, then I think we should all definitely do it as a weekly thing because that commitment, you know, it brings people back. So um, there's a lot of replay, replay value for a podcast, which is actually sort of, you know, actually does it every week. So that's one thing. I just, it's just that the one thing is if you guys are only subscribed to me, then, oh Christ, my computer is about to take off, I think. Yeah, the fan's turned on. It's gone really loud. Um, but if you guys are only subscribed to me, then you will have only seen one podcast because um, what we do is we sort of share it. It goes on each one of our channels. So there's five of us guys that can split the podcast. So uh, I'll make sure I leave a link in the description to all the channels that are involved. You guys have heard me talk about these guys countless times. So just make sure you go and subscribe, you know, you got to trust me. I wouldn't let you down. Uh, these guys are worth the subscription. And um, yeah, and if ever the podcast is up but not on my channel, then I'll always do like a link video. And it's just something that if you guys have got like an hour, uh, hour free, maybe you're doing a bit of studying or something and you don't want to do it in silence, you want to actually listen to something, which is kind of related to the gaming community and kind of just a bunch of lads having a bit of banter and a bit of laugh, then yeah, you just listen to it it's fun it's good it's good times we enjoy it uh, it's something that i definitely wanted to do for a long time and uh that dog stole my kill right there i was about to pistol whip that guy um yeah i think this gameplay is sort of coming towards the end now i can see the score is yeah i think we're triple capping them and we win this game quite comfortably i joined late uh so that's why i haven't really got any caps because we already had the flags i go 32 and 7 Thank you for watching. Low kill streaks, 32-7, quad feed. Please leave a thumbs up, and I'll catch you guys later. Bye.